Chuck Member Gore, Rock and PRS. Been a while. I guess several weeks. Anyway, down straight to business. Um, we got some Humphreys McGee party and peeps uh, rocking right now. And uh, kind of the appropriate uh, music, I think, to uh, talk about in less than a week. Well, actually, a week. Um, a week and a day. Uh, Fish will be at Dick's for the first of three nights. And the really good news is the third night, never miss a Sunday show. They're going to be. Um, casting it and I'm gonna be there and I'm gonna watch it. I might watch the whole thing I don't know we'll see how it goes what do we expect for Dix this year well I'm coming with no expectations after a really great Baker's dozen run let's just say it's gonna be a great Dix and let's just surrender to the flow and make it happen what do you think looking forward to it um, as I'm sure all you guys are uh, ladies and gents but anyway um, I'm wearing this hat today because once again, while at the liquor store, ABC store, if you're in North Carolina, um, I got snagged by promotional products, but uh, this was actually on sale. So today, we're going to be sampling Beauregard Dix's Southern Vodka. This is actually distilled in Charleston, South Carolina, uh, where uh, last fall I saw fish. Actually, it was North Charleston. This is... Uh, corn vodka and it's priced right and I got a free hat which is looking pretty cool um, I needed a new trucker's hat and I needed some vodka so there you go one package and it was on sale um, so you know you can't really beat that well actually you can if you can get the damn thing open hold on fucking hell. oh has a cork okay let's see what this mm, let's see what this, this is distilled six times let's see what this is like folks here we go I'm out Ice melted. It's been incredibly hot. Today was a little bit cooler here in uh, LA, Lenore area. Uh, get it? Here we go. We're gonna let it melt for a minute. While we're gonna let, while it's melting for a minute, we're gonna talk for a minute about Color Guard. Have you seen this thing? I mean, you know, it's all well and good to screen yourself for cancer, especially retinal cancer, because it's really bad, bad stuff. But they have a thing now where you take a dump, put it in a box, call UPS, and they ship it out. How would you like to be the UPS? What can brown do for you? Well, now brown is carrying some brown. Oh, good Lord. Um, anyway, color guard. Take a dump in a box, ship it to us. We'll tell you whether you got cancer or not. You know, truth is stranger than fiction. Anyway, let's go ahead and let's sample some of this. Beauregard Dix's Southern Vodka. It's supposed to be good. It's a boutique vodka and the price is right. Here, let's give it a shot. Okay, it definitely tastes like a corn vodka. Has that kind of sort of moonshiny flavor to it. But it's really smooth. Didn't really give it a whole lot of time to melt. Initially smooth. Corn flavor, slight burn afterwards. That's actually not bad. Not bad at all. 80 proof, uh, distilled in beautiful Charleston, South Carolina. Um, does it meet the Grey Goose test? No, we still love Grey Goose, my favorite vodka. But it's pretty good. Um, it's not bad. And I got the free trucker hat, you know, so that's that's really a cool thing. Anyway, um, Enough rambling on, I guess. Um, again, looking forward to Dick's. It's been a really great summer. Um, I think uh, the fact that they uh, uh, that they um, streamed the uh, Dayton show for, uh, might suggest that they're going to have some really cool things going. I know they're going to have cool things going on at Dick's. Sunday night's going to be really special. Again, a big shout out to how much I enjoyed Dayton and the summer tour. So we're looking forward to Dick's in a week. Chuck Limburg Gore, Rockin' PRS. Peace.